A rich legacy of economical prowess and a contemporary culture, Osaka is a harmonious assortment of international cultures. The chief hub of trade and finance in Japan offers outstanding educational opportunities to a global population. Playing a central role in the development of the region is Osaka University. Osaka University was founded in 1931 as one of the seven imperial universities of Japan and now has expanded to one of Japan's leading comprehensive universities. The university has now embarked on an open research revolution as Japan's most innovative university and among the most innovative institutions in the world, according to the Nature Innovation Index 2017. The university's ability to innovate from the stage of fundamental research through the creation of useful technology with economic impact stems from its broad disciplinary spectrum. Here, you will find the Intelligent Robotics Laboratory headed by Professor Hiroshi Ishiguro. This facility encourages studies based on unique ideas in the field of robotics. There are many difficulties in communication, especially in Japan or Eastern Asia, so because many Japanese people are shy. Students hesitate to ask questions to the teacher or patients about their doctors. I try to install、uh, such a robot into the hospital or a school. I observe the communication between humans and robots. My future plan is to、uh, extend the robot application. Uh, to the world,、uh, but robot application is not widely used. So I want to、uh, solve the technical issue of installing the robot and realize that w o r l d、uh, individual person can easily use a robot. I think the robot can be a little bit more popular. <laughs> When you think of robotics, first thing comes to your mind is Japan. And when you say Japan and robotics at the same time, You go directly to the big names in robotics in this field, and directly you will look at Ishiguro Laboratory. We have a lot of international students from all over the world. We are eight students, in which five of us are internationals and three are Japanese. When you come to a, such a big name laboratory, you will think you will get lost in this complexity of their research, but What they do in it is make it easier for us international students. Society is in this transition phase of having robots in our daily lives. And a lot of people feel hesitant, feel, can feel even afraid of interacting with a robot. So, what we want to do is ease out this, this integration. The university has a, a lot of events. Particularly for international students, also a lot of associations. I took part on one of them. We have, of course, parties and fun activities, but also a lot of cultural events as well. I'm developing a conversation robot that can talk with humans in the real world. And I'm interested in two directions. The one direction is the making the、uh, robust mechanism for the robot、uh, with. Uh, which the robot can keep talking with the human in the real world. The, at the same time, I'm interested in how the artificial technology like robot can help the human to have a better conversation. My goal is to realize Android can interact with humans and、uh, just focus on the physical interaction between Android. So, In the future, we want to realize、uh, Android that can work in the real environment. Osaka University has a good support system for the researchers' family, so they support not only me but also the family.、Uh, it's、uh, very good for us to do、uh, good research. I have established a new research field that is called、uh, human robot interaction in robotics. I think this is the most important contribution. I thought it's quite important to work with the philosophical people、uh, by using the,、uh, my robot. And after that, we are working together and we are running a conference and we are running a project together. We are developing two types of、uh, humanoid robots. One is a very humanoid robot, the other is a small robot like robot. 
And very human-like robot is very important for studying the human nature. Our motivation is to study what human is by creating a very human-like robot. We need to carefully discuss how to use the AI and robot technologies. So, so we need to make a good balance. But uh, you know, we never stop technology development. We want to have a much better AI and robots and improve our life and extend the human possibilities. The Intelligent Robotics Laboratory envisions a future in which intelligent robots and humans are partners. Explore robotics. Explore Osaka. Osaka University. Live locally. Grow globally.